It's really easy to see why the Southern Forest wine region is many people's favourite region. I think Paul's going to have a really good time. Being able to visit Warren Grange, Rick showed us around and I was super excited about all the heirloom vegetables that he grows, all the pumpkins, but the tomatoes just blew me away. Marin is, for me, something that we have on the menu all the time. Being able to get it straight out of the dam at Pembley and, and cooking it, you know, within minutes is something really special. Beautiful. Shall we uh, go cook some of these up? We visited a few people already and just the amount of produce that everybody has. Like, Everyone has the best. Oh, it's so good. Marin, avocados, finger limes, there's macadamias here. It's, um, it's next level. I'm really excited about your marron dish. So what I've done is chosen just two different things for us to look at today, sparkling wine and pinot. So we are currently at Pemberley and they do a range of sparkling wines and pinots. It's a pretty good way to start the morning, yeah, right? We yeah, can, we'll have to top this up. This is the Piccadilly Tête de Cuvée. See, it sits on your palate. Mm. But I think the length of flavour on this will help with the, the meat and then the Pemberley sparkling. I think that's going to be spot on. Good, let's do it. All right, cheers. Cheers. Okay, so we're just going to keep it super simple to highlight the beautiful flavours of the Marin. We've also been out to Warren Grange, so really excited to, to pair them with the Marin. And we're going to keep this dish super simple. We're going to chop up a whole bunch of these tomatoes so we get a, like a depth of flavour. We're going to cook that down with a bit of the olive oil. Yep. All those flavours really infuse. We're going to put this guy to sleep. We quickly blanch him, yep. remove the shells. With the shells, we're going to roast them off, infuse some oil with them. So we're not wasting any of them out. We use every single part. We might also smoke this guy a little bit. We've gotten some paper bark from this property um, that Dave's got for us this morning. With some of the, the marron oil. Go. Marin, marin and tomatoes. Marin and tomato, look at it. <laughs> it doesn't get fresher or more local than this. That that really speaks to how good the ingredients are in this region. I can taste the paper bark. Just lightly. I mm, paper it's beautiful. It's beautiful. These are perfect flavours together. They work perfectly together. It's really exciting. Delicious. Cheers. Mm.